Welcome back to my channel. This is Off Brand, the channel dedicated to showing fashion opinion, emphasis on opinion. Hey guys, welcome back to this week's Black Friday, this Black American History Month. And this week we're talking about Christopher John Rogers. But before we get started, make sure you are subscribed. Make sure you have those notifications on because you do not want to miss any of this great fashion content. Christopher John Rogers was born and raised in Baton Rouge. His love for fashion first started when he began watching Project Runway. Afterwards, he found himself searching John Galliano videos on YouTube and creating comic books with his friends, which sparked his interest in the idea of costumes and how they affect characters. His passion was also largely encouraged by his parents, who would find him extracurricular teaching lessons in order to further his artistic side, where he actually first learned how to sew. He was also largely influenced by his grandmother and the parishioners at the church his grandmother attended. He saw them create an elevated version of themselves each and every Sunday. After studying at Savannah College of Art, he moved to NYC where he won the Vogue Fashion Fund and he showed at New York Fashion Week. This led to the creation and growth of his label, which has since been worn by Rihanna, Beyonce, Michelle Obama, Tracy Ellis Ross and Kamala Harris. Now Rogers has stated that he designs for the women who creates their own world. He doesn't design for those who dress to impress, but want to enjoy the journey of getting ready. And honestly, I think that's really clear in his clientele. Now, personally, one of my favorite CJR shows is the Fall 2020 Ready to Wear, where we saw iridescent and neon colors from orange to dual purples, blues, and greens. He gave us fantasy as well as memory, where he referenced pyro inspired neck ruffles, Grace Jones-esque, 80s shoulders and 70s disco colors and flair. One of my favorite pieces was famously worn by Zendaya at the 2020 Emmys. I mean, come on, the plunge with the purple. Stunning. Overall, Christopher John Rogers is colorful, bold, and fun. I really enjoy his use of color, shapes, silhouette, and honestly, I love how he caters to black women. I know his label is meant for all shapes, sizes, and genders, but I love his reverence for black women and the black community. And it's nice to see black young labels that are growing still show that reverence and love to their community. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's episode of Black Friday. If you did, make sure you press that like button below and comment below. Who would you like to see me talk about next? Who haven't I covered? And what do we think of this video essay style? I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Hey,